In this video, I'm going to show us how to add the little tooth that's cut out on the bottom edge of our part. To do this, I'm going to start once again by just coming through and deleting uh, some guidelines I don't need. Um, in this right now, basically, I've got mine all cleaned up, which is good. The one I have left is the 1 and 7 16 mark, which I'm going to end up using again, so I don't need to delete it. Um, but anyway, the next thing I'm going to do is go to the tool I use again to lay out my piece or get guidelines, and that's the tape measure tool. I'm going to go from the midpoint over here on the green axis, select it with it that point and I'm going to go across the bottom here and I'm going to click when I get a blue mark and that is going to be our halfway. So it says 2 and 11 30 seconds because it's half of a 16th. Um, at the same time that's where I want to select here in order to start my tooth. Now the next two guidelines I'm going to make are going to be for the top side of my tooth and that is going to be half of that eighth inch dimension. So half of an eighth of an inch is one sixteenth. So if I click and go to the left and the right and type in one sixteenth, it'll give me a guideline there. Same thing going to the left, guideline there, and then on the bottom, I'm going to do the same thing, but just for the uh, other dimensions. So this is going to be the, the half of an inch divided in two. So coming over here, going an eighth of an, or sorry, a fourth of an inch one way. And then from the middle line over here, going a fourth of an inch to the right also. Now, here I have my small tooth top set up and my bottom set up. Now I just need to know how far into this piece this goes and that is my last dimension which is the half inch dimension. So one half of an inch going up, enter. What that does for me is gives me the ability to go to my pencil tool which is the line and then select on the intersection to intersection to intersection to intersection. So one more time here we go click, 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 and click on those four intersections and now I'm ready to use my eraser tool. I don't need these guidelines anymore and I don't need this bottom portion of that tooth. Hope this helps. Thanks for watching.